welcome back to my channel if you are new here welcome my name is Kaya Moore so here on this channel I really love to give simple easy tips on how to care for our natural hair and then also I just really love to keep our routine simple and stress free <laughs> so today in this video I did want to accommodate my ladies that have a little more finer hair strands because I have a lot of hair but my strands are very fine so I don't want you to feel discouraged you feel like you can't do a mini twist style because your hair strands are more fine you can now the only thing difference this style might take a little longer than the previous style that I did in my um, part one video I'll put that video down in the description box below so I don't have a favorite I actually like both there are times where I would do the first one or if I definitely want more of a um, fuller look I would definitely opt to this style okay ladies so i'm gonna start off with freshly washed hair my hair is damped i'm not gonna be blowing it out this time this is definitely also for my ladies who just do not want to blow dry your hair i did see a question out there saying do i do mini twists and then sit under a hooded dryer i have never tried that method i think it'd be a great method when you're using like a hair mousse to do your mini twist that way when you're applying that that mousse it's able to set exactly at the length that you desire so I believe that is a great way to um, use the hooded dryer so today I am gonna keep it simple and just use one product I'm gonna use the Shea Moisture Curl and Style Milk I really love this product because it's kind of like an all-in-one for me it keeps my hair nice and hydrated and moisturized and then also too I don't want to use too many products this time around because I am going a lot smaller with my twist and I don't want my twist to feel like weight down you can go behind this cream with a nice light oil that is a great way to lock in that moisture as well that's just um, another tip that you can definitely do with these twists a couple tips here is just one you do want to go smaller with your mini twist that's one way to get that nice full look and then also too you can spray water on your hair strands the purpose of that it's going to help your hair strands expand and add a nice full look to it when you do use one product that's lightweight with the light oil behind it that's another way to keep your hair looking nice and full ladies when I'm doing this size with my mini twist um, I don't start off with the braid so the smaller you go with your mini twist the more careful you do have to be you do want just to split your hair down the middle and untwist your I mean untwist and two strand twist your hair the reason being if you start off with the braid with this size later down the road when you go to refresh your twist or you go to take them out you can actually do more harm than good you can create a nice at that root and it'll be harder to take your twist down now that I am at the top of my head I'm not really parting um, neatly I just kind of make my row first and then I just start grabbing piece by piece and then just continue the twisting it kind of cuts down a lot of time too from uh, neat parting it's a great way to just you know grab the hair and go and you're able to continue your mini twist Remember, everyone's hair strands are completely different, so having finer hair does not put you in a box. I know that it could be challenging to wear um, our natural hair in different styles, but 
it's so beautiful that you're not limited to just one style have fun be creative try different styles there are wash and goes twist outs um, perm rod sets there's so many different styles that you can play with remember your goal is to embrace your hair journey stay inspired continue to get all the ideas that you can but don't get caught up in trying to get your hair to look like someone else because you're it's just discouraging remember all of our hair are different and my hair comes out different every single time my twist outs come out different my wash and goes come out different like every time I can't even remake certain looks <laughs> I'll try but it just does not go in my favor and that's okay it's all that's what this journey is all about ladies I'm also going to be showing you how I refresh my twist after two weeks and then that way it can last me another two weeks so stay tuned for that and then I'm also going to be showing you how I achieve my nightly routines so I know a lot of you've been asking me too what do I do at night and what do I do in the morning so I got you I will be making that separate video I do like to keep my mini twist in for like three to four weeks. I don't go any longer than that. I know I was asked if um, my hair will start locking. I haven't experienced that. I have gone um, a lot longer than four weeks before. The only thing is with that, my hair just felt really dry. So that's why I typically just go no longer than three to four weeks, only from my personal experience. Now, I do believe that your hair can lock depending on your texture, but if I would have kept it in maybe about for two to three months, I wanna say maybe it'll start locking, but I don't ever keep them in that long. It just gives me a break when I do my mini twist from just uh, stop playing in my hair or styling my hair. every week and ladies of course any products that I use check down in the description box below and I'll definitely see you on the next one I love you all may your day and week be blessed and remember there's no right or wrong way to rock your curls they're beautiful because you love them okay so I'll see you on the next one bye